Okay, guys, here we go. And I wouldn't at all be surprised if this match stole the show here tonight. Youngstown better be ready because this match has the potential to be a match of the year candidate. She's in control now following that slam. Not the first time we've seen this move tonight. Let's quickly discuss Wolf for a moment. We know she can compete, but how is she going to actually win this thing? Here's somebody who's willing to do just about anything to get to the top, and that's the way it should be here in WWE. One thing I can say about her is if she does get beat, it won't be because of a lack of preparation or effort. She makes it look easy. Nia Jax seems to have lost a step now. She's going to need to find a way to mount an offense here. That's all well and good, Cole, but unless this leads to some sort of submission hold, it's all for naught. It's been an amazing match up to this point, guys. She's got her right where she wants her. This could be it for her. She's looking at it. An emphatic finisher. Corey, let's look at this again. She's in control now. Whack! Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Another direct hit with that chair. Nothing like a few good old-fashioned chair shots. I think she's trying to prove a point here. She drops her hard. She's back in full control now. Dropped like a bad habit. Back now inside the ring. Here she goes, back in the ring now. This is another example of the carnage this beauty can create. What an unbelievable slam. Hits her with a dizzying headbutt. This is an incredible performance being put on by Nia Jax. Big reversal for her there. Set match, this one is over. This one was over once she locked it in. Here is your winner, Vivacious Wolf. Without even breaking a sweat, this one is over. And to be honest, Michael, neither of these amazing women have anything to be ashamed of. Wow, just wow. I'm speechless. What an amazing match.